Your wife is here, sir. She coming? Mm-hmm. She, she not sitting beside me. <laughs> she's being her different, right? No, she's going to sit right beside you. Jesus. To hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. <laughs> Okay. Welcome back to my channel. Today we have the famous, the exalted, the Charles family. We have Miss Gloria in the flesh, Chief in the flesh, ready to go. You all know what you're here to do today. What am I here for? <laughs> you know you're here to give the people and me. Because I don't think we've really talked about this type of thing, you know. Dating advice. You know I don't like this camera business. I know. I okay. know. I know. If there's some, you know, let me say it in front of them. If there's something that you would like to take out during the week, just let me know. And I'll take it out. As a comfort. As a comfort. Anyway, we are starting straight. When is a good age to start dating? Is there any set age to start dating? Oh, so you are I'm saying you about mm -hmm. dating. Mm -hmm. Camera roll. There is no specific age. Mm -hmm. But for a young lady, mm -hmm. I believe you should wait until Number one, you're mature, you're educated, you have an idea of exactly what you want to do in life and what type of partner you would like. Well, can I make a comment? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. When you say dating to somebody, the first thing that comes in mind is a man and a woman and what a man and a woman can do publicly and privately. Oh yes. And therefore I say, dating means having a friend to go to a party with, mm -hmm. or go on a trip with, mm -hmm. or go with parents. Mm -hmm. That is not a problem. Mm -hmm. But as we understand dating these days, right. A man and a woman is starting out on a public, big life. Mm -hmm. And I am very concerned about those who just want to date, want to go to parties, want to drink, want to hug up, mm -hmm. want to get involved, sex, mm -hmm. and then come and say, Mama, something get wrong. Mm -hmm. So for me, Parents should guide their children up the high roads and the low roads. Mm -hmm. The respect that is demanding of a man, young man or older man or middle aged, for a woman has to be established. And if the woman has to make sure the man you are going to go out with, mm -hmm. He has respect for you, mm -hmm. your parents, mm -hmm. your profession that you're pursuing, and so forth. So, I don't have a problem with dating, right. provided you are taught, you learn, and you understand what, what are the pitfalls, mm -hmm. high road and the low road. That's, what, that's why I say when you're mature, mm -hmm. when you're educated, mm -hmm. when you can take care of yourself, mm -hmm. when you know the 
what standard mm -hmm. who you want the type of you person have mm -hmm. you have to know you have to be aware of as, as daddy says mm -hmm. the pitfalls right. what other point mm -hmm. dating does not mean a husband you know no. or a wife no but dating means that the person you are going out with has respect and understanding for you. Or you have right. certain attraction because you have to be attracted to yes, that yes, individual mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. for you to go out to with go that out. person. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. What age did you both start dating? Dating? Mm -hmm. Did we date? We never got an opportunity to I was, I was 26 years old. Mm -hmm. I had my professional mm -hmm. yes. I had my job. Mm -hmm. I was ready to find a partner. You're ready. Find somebody. And I know exactly the type of person I had in mind. Was it him? Hmm? Was it him? What hit him? Was it him? I don't understand you. The person that you had in mind, uh -huh. was it him? Was it him? Physically? No. Oh, right. But the, the type of <laughs> individual that I met, <laughs> the emotional, the spiritual, the thing, mm -hmm. he was a mm -hmm. calm, calm, yeah. intelligent. Mm -hmm. Very intelligent. I'm gonna check him out. Mm -hmm. This guy had a job. Just to see. Didn't like the profession too much that he had, but what profession was that? Politician. Oh, right. Trade unionist. Mm -hmm. Was a trade unionist. I've never really liked that. But well, for me, the thing is this, you know. What was important to me is that. He was a believer in God. That's and to make it better, he was an Adventist. Mm -hmm. I'm an Adventist. Mm -hmm. Went to an Adventist school. So I know that he must have good values. values from and I tell you, our first date we went on was to go to church. Real man. Church. Let me say this. From I was seven years old, my mother told me that I told her I'm gonna marry a nurse. Come on. The reason for that, I was born in the high mountains mm -hmm. of Jamaica, what they call mountains. <coughs> where you had no paved roads. Mm -hmm. No electricity, Macedonia. no running water, mm -hmm. but you also have a public health nurse okay. that comes to school okay. and mm -hmm. comes to home to examine the surroundings and guide you and the dressing white. Mm -hmm. So you like I, that? I, I, I like that and I <laughs> told her, my mother said I told her, when I grew up I want to marry to a nurse. Mm -hmm. Can wear the white. And I've always had an attraction to nurses mm -hmm. because of their profession. Mm -hmm. so, so, when I, so when I met this lady, she was a... She's a nurse, if you don't know, she's a nurse. She's a nurse. Yeah, uh -huh. she's a nurse. Family nurse, practitioner. Sorry, no, don't get it wrong, family <laughs> nurse, practitioner. She, she was a nurse. Mm -hmm. and, uh, she was fortunate <laughs> that I... Place my eyes on her. Yes, she was fortunate. She was fortunate. Thank God. <laughs> but I have warned all my nieces and nephews do not take the road that I took. Oh. You won't be that lucky. Mm -hmm. Explain on that. Okay. Explain on that. Explain on that point, sir. But because I walked into a party mm -hmm. by myself. Mm -hmm. Which is strange. Quite strange. Strange part, young And I walk like in you. there and saw this lady sat down mm -hmm. with a long glass of turned out to be Pepsi. Okay. But I walked over to her and said, 
Coke. You have to be very careful drinking rum and coke at party. You get okay. I'm not having rum and coke. No. I'm having right. just coke. Mm -hmm. So I get a chance to start. Mm -hmm. So speaking to her. Well. Which uh, party was this? Eh? Whose party a, was this? Which was Christmas. One of one of all. Christmas. One of the Christmas parties. Mm -hmm. And um, 19th of December. What? That's my birthday. Oh. 19th of December. 19th of December. Yes. And you heard it here first. 19th of December. That's my birthday. That's what's in my birthday. Yeah. That's so crazy. And I, I, I didn't know that. I was, I was requested to, to drop her home because mm -hmm. she she was. Mm -hmm. So the real thing is, mm -hmm. she was there alone. Yes, and you and went I went alone. alone. Weird. It's weird. Weird. Especially at a party like that. Yeah. But. Mm -hmm. To speed it up, mm -hmm. fast forward, I think it was designed mm -hmm. by powers that we had no concern. Yeah. Yeah. It has been 52 years mm -hmm. since we met wow. and we have mm -hmm. had our first quarrel, wow. fight. Mm -hmm. fight. We haven't slept in different beds because of a disagreement. Mm -hmm. This is not possible for men like me. <laughs> what do you mean by that, sir? What do you mean by that, sir? I mean, mm -hmm. I mean, you know. You know, someone like yourself. That's strong. Mm -hmm. I, I like you. She's alright, you know. Mm -hmm. And when she produced when not. Listen, listen, I we didn't have the opportunity to date. As other people do, because we met December the 19th and we got married on June the 21st. Mm -hmm. so I, went away. Year. I went away for three months. And then, when we met, within a month, he gave me a friendship ring. I don't ever do that these days. I used to see those a lot, but I have a beautiful friendship ring. Mm -hmm. And he left for England for about two, two to three months. Yes. So we communicate, we communicate by writing. Wow. And every now and then you can phone. Mm -hmm. So you have to Move say, to say um, all right, I'm going to call you on such and such a day. That's so you time. prepare yourself to be at home wow. on that day because there weren't any cell phones cool. at that time. And so, he came back, wait man, he came back and then he came back with an engagement ring. Lord gee. So you're buying an engagement ring of four So our dating is over the phone. Mm -hmm. You understand what And we got engaged and within two months or so, we got married. Within 60 days. She hold on to me? No, mm -hmm. never let you go. She wouldn't let me go. <laughs> For that. He's not gambling. Mm -hmm. I checked the man out. Right. Went to his house. Mm -hmm. Family. You have to meet the family. You have to meet the family. And you will have an idea of what make up this individual. Mm -hmm. Very important. It's true. They're a religious family. They're all Adventists. And that just sealed the deal. That sealed it. Fine. A very loving guy, you know, a lot mm -hmm. of people would believe he's rough. It's not true. He's not a that rough guy. Mean? When he when that he is through, through the gate, mm -hmm. he is a I call him a teddy bear. A big big bear. Oh. A big big bear. Oh. Oh, God. He's loving. So loving. Loyal. Playful. Playful. Very respectful. Jokester. Very respectful. If you do if a man is not respectful, don't even don't bother with him. If he's not loving and loyal, don't bother with him. If you can't make joke with him, don't bother with him. He has to be caring and have to have a calm spirit. That's, I think that's very important because I think a lot of young men these days don't have that calming. Have to be You know calm. what I mean? They're all hoo 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 and bad man this and bad man right, that. Right, they're There's ready to no chop up on the street. <laughs> I have no. never heard him with a curse word. Mm -hmm. Not in my presence. 
and, and that is and, and, and I'm like him. He's very like honest. Because I'm a politician um, and it's not expected well, it's, that I can be nice. Okay. <laughs> they, they used to call me Mr. Ting. Because I'm your Ting a dream. Pure Ting. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So with that, really? I said, Seven, seven, four drink, row, four rounds of my room, and one thing. Are you serious? Mm hmm. Really? Never. Like, you don't have a signature drink or anything? Some people really have signature drinks, like no. they'll say a scotch is what this man drinks. Yeah, yeah. at home. Some man or really abroad. does that. Mm -hmm. My son, Peter, mm -hmm. advised me that I have to have a little glass of red wine, wine. like two times or three times. And I don't hold my nose. Jesus. And drink it. Hold your nose. To taste bad. Hold your nose. I have never gone into a rum bar and purchased whiskey, rum, I go high, and put it into my stomach. I put a cigarette or a ganja into my brain. Right. This rubbish about you get some ganja and make you bright. Mm -hmm. What is this? I can't believe it. What is this? <laughs> Rubbish. <laughs> what makes you bright is when you have a, have a diet of vegetable and fish and, and you know. Move the Coconut water. Mm, wash off your hearts. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. Go ahead. Go ahead. That's it. No, sir. Oh, well, no, give us the rest. I just need to get myself together really quick. Well, you guys stated what you think the stages of dating are, which is the stages of dating, which you said is some people are friends first, and then it moves to you pick your one, and then it moves to... You must to always be friends. Mm -hmm. So I'll point for you, what, what, are what are the stages of dating What are the stages of dating And I am sure I'm right. Mm -hmm. You cannot do everything one time. True. You are pursuing your degree at university or education. Mm -hmm. You can have several friends to study with. The minute you put on a book and start up of parties and trips and this, that's it. You, 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 you are losing. So, okay, so you finish your education. Mm -hmm. The next step is you want to get a job or you want to have a family. Mm -hmm. So you decide and have a grandma on your dates mm -hmm. or a new one. Somebody that you would want to live with. Mm -hmm. And that is not a trial and error. That's true. No, that's it's a serious thing. You have to, you have to mm -hmm. investigate it. You have to know what you're doing. You have to know what you're doing right there. You have to check the family. Check it out. You have to go to the Don't family. Don't let nobody fool you. You have family. to go to the family. Tell you where you want to live with. See what I'm getting myself into. Oh. It's true. Mm -hmm. Very important. Mm -hmm. Family tells who you want to live with. So, Grandma, this question is, well, it's for both of you. How can you know when a man truly loves you? When the, when he how when he truly loves you and how can you know when a woman truly loves you? Well let me take it first. Alright, you take it. First thing, we are lie. <laughs> to keep it with why we start there? We are why why we start there, Grandpa? The lie. Because, because, <laughs> the this, this, because the word it's love, true. what does it mean? Mm -hmm, it's true, it's true. I love you. What's the thing? Mm -hmm. What I do for you? I mean, I I love you. You said to everybody. I tell everybody I you love said, you. I love you, my daughter. In the street. I love my yeah. daughter. I love my friend. <laughs> In the street. I love all my friends. Right. Okay? So, when it comes to... Because you have to separate the six in a room. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I have met so many women that I love. <laughs> right? I love some of them. They're pretty. I what? love some because they're bright. <laughs> I love some because they, because, because, they, because they do certain things that I appreciate. Mm -hmm. And I love some for many other reasons. Right. But I am telling you that loving a man, I can come and say I love you. Mm -hmm. If you're nice shape, mm -hmm. have a nice, nice body. I nice. well, you know, remember, and I want your friends to know right, yes. that sex. Is a milestone that everybody wants to reach. Mm -hmm. And 
the right woman preserve that. The right man pursue that. And preserve it. Well, depending I, on the woman. The, 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 so I say you have to you set mean, your if, standard. It, it is very, it is very unfair for women. <laughs> but it is a true that it is a woman who have to decide which man she's going to lie down with. If you are a drinker and you get drunk and hug up and love and don't think beyond that, you're not trouble. Because I don't know if I'm right to say this because maybe some men are better than me. Mm -hmm. But you meet a nice girl and she pop you and boy. <laughs> and when you <laughs> and when she, when you when you move forward to say heart. <laughs> Not, not that you, you get yourself free. You know, but if she says, come on, you go. You say, you go on, you go on, you say yes. Yeah. And you yeah. say, mm -hmm. you ever see these dates? Watch the TV. Mm -hmm. Everybody having a wine, mm -hmm. glass of wine, a second glass of wine, until mentally yeah. then they get into the bed. And when all is over, it was a mistake. Joe, I'm going to tell you a secret. Oh, right. And it's the first I'm going to say. After I met Laura, okay. I rushed after her. Mm -hmm. And she said, hold it a minute. Mm -hmm. Make a decision. Mm -hmm. she Do you yeah. want she me? Mm -hmm. Or you want that? Yeah. Exactly. You have to know yourself. You have to have your standards, girls. And I immediately hold a minute and say, so I want different. you. Mm -hmm. Because, because said, of the well, stuff. And she said, well, pursue that. Mm -hmm. There are very few women who have that opportunity. Mm -hmm. They're either drunk, over love, uh, under love. Crying and be the one that going find nobody else in life. Mm -hmm. Rubbish. So I was 30 and when I met her and I met holy for woman mm -hmm. from Jamaica to America to London to Canada to And he was yeah. 35, when I was 36. Mm -hmm. I was 26. Oh, that's 10 years. Going on 27. How many years are you guys? 10 years? Okay, about and it 8 took, years apart. And it took me one and a half hours to propose to her. What? What is it? One and a half hour? Yeah. I met, I met her. What? I met her. the same night. He said, what? I'm, I'm going to marry to you, you know. And I love all of this <laughs> well, I think you have to Give us up. a story then, sir. Give us a story. When, when, I, met her, when, I, when I met her at the, at the party, mm -hmm. and they asked me to take her home. Right. And we were driving up the road. I said to her, you're a nurse, you seem to be a nice person, she said. Anyway. Uh -huh. So I said, do you have a boyfriend? Mm -hmm. She said, well, I have a friend. Hey. So, she so said, I, I get the message that she So you know she has somebody. So I said, so you must be quite involved. She mm -hmm. said, oh no. No. We're not involved mm -hmm. as you think. Right. Because she's studying to be a pastor. Yeah. Oh, the man. Oh, the man said, yeah. The man is studying to be a pastor. So I went on and checked out a few more little things. Mm -hmm. Her grandmother is 70 and 20. She's a senior nurse. She said, me like you know? that. And so it was about two hours. I said to her, I told her to say to you, she said, go ahead. I want to marry you. She said, excuse me, Mr. Charles, don't you know? <laughs> 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 no, I didn't know. I love how the <laughs> Yeah, I love how the She said, excuse me, Mr. Charles, don't you come in now? And I said, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Can I come <laughs> see you tomorrow evening? <laughs> this was it was a Friday evening. Friday evening. I said, Can I come and see you Saturday evening? She said, 
I thought you would have invited me to church. As, as you should, as you should. Mm -hmm. Because you said you said never like this. Mm -hmm. I said, I'd pick you up in the morning. <laughs> so, all right. Mm -hmm. Now, church is 9 30, you know. Mm -hmm. And I was there from 8 o'clock. Oh my God, I'm excited. Wait, wait, wait. We're to church. That's the first day. Church. Church. Mm -hmm. church. So, it's I can. College. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. but at that time it was called West Indies mm -hmm. College, Northern Caribbean University Chapel. Uh, I went down there show up and said, I'm going to be there. Yeah, yeah. But no, I'm not the best girl. Yes. I'm the best girl. 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 And even if anything happens tomorrow, which we don't expect it, mm -hmm. but 52 years. 52 years. Wow, that's a lifetime. Right? Your mother mm -hmm. and six others. Mm -hmm. And she is responsible for all that they have achieved. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. Mm -hmm. she, yes. Some good pick. All right, we're gonna do like two more. <laughs> you cannot tell me you're not enjoying your time with me. You guys are enjoying yourselves. Go ahead, man. Come on, man. All right, so now we're in the marriage now. It's not a touchy subject now, you know. Mm -hmm. But the people want to know. People yes. want to know. Right. How important <laughs> is sex? in the marriage as a married couple as a married couple yes, yes. i don't know i've never been married i don't know they don't know they never sex married. was created by god you know amen Six, six is uh, you're married now you know say married now so, so you don't have to run it down mm -hmm. and it has to now be it's there it has to be convenient it has to be Peaceful. I like the peaceful. That's a nice word. And uh, she might not want to hear this. She's not listening. We have certain discussions. Mm -hmm. early, to be had? We are early morning discussions. Okay. Talk about the children. Talk about things. Plan. And look at things more, right? Mm -hmm. In the morning. It's time. Start your day off. <laughs> You go back here. Okay. Thanks. Let me tell you something. Right. Which I think young people should know. Thank you. Because when you're married, sex don't last forever. That's a very important statement. Because I think that a lot of people now, they're probably just dating based off of attraction and just go put. Those things fade. More than that. Those things do fade. It does fade as you grow older. So that stability, that respect, that love, that everything has to be there. Because it doesn't last forever. A lot of men after they reach a certain age, they don't know. They don't. They, they don't have the knowledge. <laughs> it's true. Mm. They don't do the research. So, at a certain stage, you find problem in the marriage, mm. and they leave the wife, and they find a young girl. Mm -hmm. Beware of those men who come to you and say. I'm going to divorce my wife. If they're going to divorce the wife, <laughs> if they're going to divorce the wife, they will divorce you too. Yes. Or they will divorce the wife and leave the children there. Mm -hmm. Some do it. Some only talk that because they want to get to you. They want mm -hmm. to have sex with you. Mm -hmm. no, that is all they want. They're not going to marry to you. Right. Well, I, I, I have never lied to a woman about my wife. I am not one of those men who tell other women that my wife now get along. Get along. 
We don't sleep in the same bed. She well, sleeps downstairs and I sleep upstairs. Separate, say, do not and talk. Yeah, do not talk. And, and, and we're soon divorced. Come on. And then you get this girl waiting. My, my, my uh, she, she coming next. Same as oh, me. Oh, yeah. Where have those men, some of the men who have beautiful, like me, mm -hmm. tell you a lie. Yeah. And I'm not have to read through before one o'clock. <laughs> you know you have to go home and read yeah. it after read through. There's, there's no way <laughs> you're going to get me sleep out of my house. Are you crazy? Are you crazy? You have to deal with sleep. And if I'm late, you take time to keep going. Mm. And you you know, you're tired of me, that's the cause. There's no need think, for that. She think you're here a long time. Mm. Are you guys ready to close the video? Yes. I think yes, I think you all yes. did a fantastic yes. job uh, here. Let me, let me close it, my All right, part. you could, right, right, sir. I I consider this interview mm -hmm. very interesting. Right. I've done an analysis of it. Okay. I find you to be searching for yourself. Yes. And some of your friends. Mm hmm And so let me warn you. Not the warning. Not the warning, Grandpa. You warning. Must, you must set standards. Set boundaries. Boundaries too. Yes. Time. You cannot handle three and four things at the same time. I can't. So anybody who is between 18 and 24 must set that period for the establishment of a profession. It's true. During that, you can, you can you meet somebody. You can meet somebody. You can meet somebody. And you can meet somebody. You can meet and it will be good to meet somebody right? during that who time. Has, who has similar mm -hmm. ambition. standard and ambition. And characteristics that you also have. But for you to be in school, mm -hmm. and you meet somebody who they are foolish, just come and go with me, I will marry you and you don't need it. Uh, let us take, a, take another, take a year off. Rubbish. Mm -hmm. so, Trying to get out so of school. I'm warning you now. Don't call me and say, Grandpa, I, I don't finish school yet, but I meet a man and I don't want to lose him. Lose him and he, yeah. uh, he, will, take, he will take care of me. I couldn't even call you guys with that. I would, I no, no, you don't need no man to take care of you. That's a big mistake, you know. know. Depending on a man to take care of you, tell no, you darling. Tell you you as a woman, you tell must me. have your thing. In other words, have something, something for yourself. Don't depend on man to take care of you. Depend you go into this relationship as a person. Partner. Mm -hmm. that, that's a word, you know, as, as a, a partner. Part when you are faced with men, tell them you have a terrible grandfather. No, you don't have to tell them that because it's not you true. You tell them that. Not true. And if them fool wrong, so you. you they know the dirt. You, you can't call me and tell me rubbish. Grandpa, uh, school is hard and I meet a man who have a house and he want to take care, care of me. What? <laughs> no, I won't do it, Grandpa. I will not do it. No, no, no. Any man, any man who it. loves you wants to see the right, best for me. The best for you. Exactly. Any I'll man who my loves you, he wants baby. to see the best of you. He wants to see you satisfied. Mm -hmm. He wants to see me have a passion. You improve. He, want, he wants to see me up. have a passion for something. Yes. He you know? wants to see me do better for myself. Better. Not having to depend on him. You use and the right word. I can't. You have a passion for something. Mm -hmm. And you meet somebody. That's why some girls get involved with elder men. Mm -hmm. uh, elder men understand the rope. Mm -hmm. Not all of them. Yes. <laughs> they are ambitious. You have some men mm -hmm. that have no ambition. That's another thing. The man has to be ambitious. Well, if they're not ambitious, it don't make sense. Maybe I'm wrong to say it that way. Let us say there are some men, mm -hmm. young and old and middle-aged, who have certain passion for success. Mm -hmm. 
and want to see you succeed. And his first approach is to assist you in your development. Follow me? Because, you know, I, I was taken away from her by the government for a mm -hmm. year. For a year. And um, if you don't know about that, my grandfather sells a book called Detained. Yes. Where can they get that book, sir? They can get it from you. Oh, they yes. can get it from me. Order it from you and I send it to you. I have four books and they can buy from you. So you're going to tell them the price or it will no, be? No, 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 no you can tell me. Yes, ma'am, they get it. You can they tell get, me. Once they buy from you, they get a discount. Well, if you want to learn about history, his history, four books. DM me. Oh God. <laughs> DM me. And you are fortunate that I love you. You know all I'm of fortunate it. that I love your mother, who is one of the very hard working member of parliament. If you don't and know. And I used to call her dead stump. Of him. Because she looked like me. Mm -hmm. She worked like me. She's ambitious like me. And she's not listening, so I tell you. All of my girls are in love with me. That's true. It's uh, true. Four girls. He's alright. He's alright. Four He's girls. All right. mm -hmm. One a businesswoman, mm -hmm. and the other three are doctors. Mm -hmm. And I give you, my, my wife wanted to investigate a little matter with me mm -hmm. and she wanted to question me in public before the girls mm -hmm. so she asked me a question and the one who was a doctor the psychologist said daddy you sent me to school yes to pay for me yes don't answer that question <laughs> and <I> meant, don't. <laughs> So <laughs> we we are happy. We're a happy family. Happy if you family. know our happy family, you know our family. Mm -hmm. Lucky. What a happy mother sing, you see. If if God is in the family, what a happy home. Mm -hmm. Happy happy home. So tell your friends that you want to finish your profession, and that is next. And this thing can go up while you know. Have a friend. Have a friend to port. But you have to have boundaries. What's the boundary? Mm -hmm. Yes, you can have set your standard. In a nice way. The yeah, way nice you way. did with him where you yeah, said, nice go on, go on. Men, you must learn the different definition for respect. And if a man don't respect you, run from him. Okay. I don't have to run. You have to I respect yourself first. Sweetheart. I just tell you. Respect yourself. I, I, I just tell you. I, I don't have to run. I, 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 I just tell you. When when you know, there was a girl, you know, mm -hmm. who called and said, if anybody call you and ask you from your daughter, tell him yes. I said, wait, wait, that <laughs> so This man, come to mommy and say, you think my father, my father wants to see where my father, and, and I have to tell him, so you have a father, the man run. <laughs> You have to say yes, it's my daughter. Bro. All my girls. Mm -hmm. I've kept my standard. Mm -hmm. None of my girls got pregnant before their profession was finished. That's right. And I didn't hide it from them to tell you what we men can do to women. Mm -hmm. We mm -hmm. lie to you. <laughs> We tell you sweet talk. Bamboo you. We make present promises. Mm -hmm. And we, we hide things from you. <laughs> Some give big present too. Mm -hmm. Who can afford it? Just to get you. We, we, give, you, we give you a false ring. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ring. And say yes, and say it is it's gold. Mm -hmm. <laughs> People. So if you did like this video, please don't forget Joe to like, brutal. comment, share. You have ending it. Oh, go, go. <laughs>
<laughs> if you did like this video please don't forget to like comment share and subscribe i love my grandparents i'm so happy that i got them here together oh, what a oh word. my god what a it word. was so hard for me to get both of them here oh my gosh but they're here because they love me so thank you miss g and miss Achaz. And if the people ask for you again, they will see you. Ready, ready for you, ready for you. Okay, okay. thank you very much. Thank you. And goodbye. Hello. Bye, sir, for now. What is it?